Hey little guys, it's DustyBurnina here with a tutorial on how to install Just Cause 2 multiplayer. Now you can only really do this uh, when the beta tests are going on as of now, um, but I'm sure that'll change once it is fully released. Uh, but what you want to do is you want to go to the website which is jc-mp.com, the link is in the description so you don't have to type that in. And when there's a test going on, now there isn't right now, but when there is, uh, there usually is going to be a post about it here with a download link so you can download the client, and there's probably going to be something up here. Uh, so that you can, you know, download it as well. And they also post it on their Facebook and Twitter, so you can get it from there as well. But basically, you just need to download the client zip file, and you need to save that to your desktop, so it's easy to get to. And then on my desktop here, I have it. And you want to right-click it and click Extract All, and then uh, just to click Extract there. And we'll minimize that, and let me just move it over here. Now, if you don't have the right-click Extract All feature, or option, uh, you want to just open it up and click extract all files does the same thing now with this client right here uh, you'll see you have some files basically you can do whatever um, you can rename the client folder whatever you want so you can name it just cause 2 multiplayer but what you need to do is you need to come to this readme and then uh, it'll say the IP now it's different mostly different for every week but they seem uh, to keep the beta dash or dot jcmp dot com but I don't know what's going on right now so yes you just want to get the IP and then you want to open up the jcmp launcher here and you want to click run then you uh, you have the beta dot jcmp dot com in there uh, if you don't then you just copy it from the readme and put it in there now you can put your nickname in so you just whatever you want and then you have to find the path to your game now you want to click this dot 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 here and it's probably going to be on your main drive. I know I have a bunch of drives, so it's kind of messed up for me, but it's different for me, I should say. Um, but it's going to be in, on your main drive or your programs drive and in your program files times 86, so your 32-bit program files there. And then your Steam and Steam apps folder, then common, then just cause 2. Now, if you need to get that again, just rewind the video a little bit. And then you want to select your just cause 2 application and then just click open here. And you'll have it there. And uh, launch options are currently supposed to be not set at all uh, because it doesn't work. And then one thing though, you do need to have Steam open. You don't need to have Just Cause 2 open, but you need to have Steam open. Uh, so just you know, open up Steam. Here I have it on my desktop. I would just open it up and you can minimize it, close it, whatever. But don't close it down completely. Just make sure it's still in your taskbar here. And uh, yeah, that's that. Now, then you want to click launch and it will launch Just Cause 2 and it'll just automatically go into multiplayer as soon as you hit enter at the start screen. Now, if you have any questions, you can leave those in the comments below and a like and a favorite would be greatly appreciated. Also, if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe for more daily content. Thanks for watching.